Welcome everyone to another episode of Game Informer's Test Chamber. We're taking a look at Mirror's Edge Catalyst coming to PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC on May 24th. Uh, but as you can see, we're playing the beta, which uh, we got early access to, but it'll be open to the Front Runners program on April 22nd, and then General Public on the 23rd. And it sounds like it's going to run for about uh, five days, so it ends April 26th. All right. I'm Andrew Reiner. That's Kyle Hilliard. I'm the guy saying all right. And he, Kyle is going to be playing Faith Connors here. Yeah. I uh, I have not touched two at all at any preview events or anything, but I really have a lot of love for the first one. I, I like the first yep. one a lot. 2008's game. Uh, kind of a free runner. We're returning to the City of Glass. And that's Faith there in right. her uh, Chell cosplay. So is she a prisoner or is this is this like... It's like a fifth element thing. We keep you here forever, Leech. Work is rewarded. Maybe you'd like another three months. Laziness comes. It would be so easy. Personal freedom comes at a price. Apologies for the beta. We got a full day ahead. We can't get rid of it. Sorry. Every employee contributes to the corporation of their choice. Has served a 12 month sentence to which nine months rash for several incidents of insubordination. Deemed ready. <laughs> is insubordination just not no, replying if it was up to, me, to people asking you questions? Hmm. Upon release, you must seek immediate employment and will be monitored through your grid link. If you do not find employment within 14 days, you'll be relocated to a Greenland facility. Do you understand these conditions? Just get me out of here. I'll also take the vibe off your head. <laughs> Dressing rooms to the left, Leech. So he was talking about the grid link. There's something that you find throughout the game called grid leaks. Okay. Uh, which you'll collect. Who's Dogen? And this is once again developed by DICE using Frostbite 3 this time. It looks sharp. Alright, so... <clears throat> and there we go. So the game is... I have two weeks to find a job, right? So I gotta go start filling out applications and stuff? Mm -hmm. Like, that's that's what the game is, right? It's Freddy Krueger, pre-burn, <laughs> pre-nightmare. Okay. All right, so I do have some control already. I can jump. You can um, probably can't, just stop looking at that and go play the I, game. I can't let... It's like... It's holding me... I, like, I can't look left and right. It's very slow. Ah. I don't know if that's on purpose. Hooray! I'm out of prison! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you guys. Ain't no one here. Oh, red door. So using the red cues again. To let you know where to hey, go. Over here. Don't get on that. So we saw the game last E3, got to play it last E3, got off to a pretty rough start. Could be anyone. Uh, well, time trial missions, stuff like that. Just stuff that didn't seem like a really good example of the game. Mm -hmm. I thought it was a weird demo. Uh, and this is part of that demo. So this is how our E3 demo started. Okay. Pick her nose. Oh, contacts. What the hell? Come on, we need to get moving. Would you wear contacts that do this? Probably. Give you a hug. Cool. Ah, I'd be into that. She's getting a headache. I wonder how close we are to that. I mean, Google Glass sort of started, mm -hmm. tried it, but it, it clear. I don't know. It kind of fell apart. I don't. I don't think it took off. But I wonder if how close we are to getting like contacts like this. I think they are developing stuff like that as we speak. I'm sure they are. I'm into it. I think it's cool. But I've never worn public contacts use in my yet, life. I don't know. So the beta itself, if you're gonna, if you get into it, uh, has some faith missions. There's some social play stuff that you can mess around with. Uh, this game does have co-op. Oh, uh, I, I actually didn't know that. I did yeah. not know it had co-op. Okay, here we go. So I jumped up a thing. Oh, I didn't even have to. Let's see. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Dirty footprints on the walls. Wipe your feet. 
All right, we're trying to get the hang of this. So apparently, if you like hold down, okay, here we go. Here we go. Get in the rhythm. Get in the rhythm. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's bobsled time. Okay. Feel the rhythm. Feel the rhyme. Into second base. Something, something. Bobsled time. Up you go. <laughs> oh. Do I need to slide down that? I don't know. Oh gosh. Guys, it's cool. I'm reformed. Is that a drone or a helicopter? Okay, so this is an enemy type. Yeah, we got yeah, I can Light attack. All right. Submit. Submit. All right, let's see. Oh. And Pretty there won't cool. be guns in this one, from what from what I'm hearing. There will be or won't. Won't. Be. So oh, the use okay. of guns from the the first game. I actually, when I played the I original, uh, my first playthrough, I went for the no shooting achievement. Uh, so I never actually used guns at any at any point when I played. It. <laughs> So there's no uh, live cooperative multiplayer, but um, it has asynchronous multiplayer. So you can okay. affect uh, the world for others and stuff like that. I, I like that stuff. I, I like I like the idea of like what you're playing by yourself, but you're seeing sort of how other people are affecting your game. So many games have you walking across balance boards. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Alley-oop. Okay, so if you hold down, you actually, you kind of do a leap automatically as you, uh, that's cool. Okay. Yeah, so I think you could do, like, races and stuff like that. Ah, oh, nice. Wall run. Da -da -da -da. Big fan of wall running in games in general. Big yes. Prince of Persia fan. That's actually why I've always been a big fan. Like, the reason I was so eager to play the first one is because I just loved the idea of, like, a Prince of Persia style first person game focused solely on the sort of platforming aspect of it, you know? Uh, and you can also place beat location emitters for other players to track down. That's kind of cool. All right. So you can hide stuff in the environment? Yeah. That's interesting. I like that. It's different. And you're not, you just kind of build up momentum, so you don't really have like a sprint button per se. Oh, this is cool. I don't know if you did that in the first game, where you kind of swung from banisters like that. Am I dumb? I, I thought I saw him jump over that. Um. Oh. <laughs> Where'd you go? Up there, up the ladder. Up to the your right. Ladder. Oh, there's there the red light. Okay. Always look for the red. Oh, that's a good point. That was, I actually kind of like that. It wasn't like super like garish red. It was just kind of like yeah, a little subtle. more subtle. Yeah. Ouch. You can kind of roll, right? Oh. Submit. Submit to me. Nice. You know, I'm jamming square, but I think I just have to press it once. I'll have to try the next guy. <laughs> nice, nice roll. Ah. What happened I to your sleeves? Nicely, but he step aside. And now they know you came this way. Like I had a choice. Sure. We need to clear out. Better take a different route to the Everdyne Tower. We'll split up again. Keep them confused. Can you make it across to those pipes? Of course. Good. Your beatlings should be calibrated by now and your runner's vision working. Just follow the red and I'll meet you at the tower. Let's go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Jinx, you owe me, I don't know, like 60 bucks. To buy a Mirror's Edge Catalyst? Yeah. I have I've inflation. You know, it's more than a Coke. All right, days. runner's vision. Let's oh, see what let's this see. looks like. R3. Oh, weird. Okay. So nothing is so since it's more kind of open worldy, your objectives aren't listed. You know, like in the old game, it was very linear. Yeah. But this one now, when you take up a mission, it paints the environment for you. So oh. the environment will be clear. Oh, oh. nice. That was awesome. So it kind of gives you a little trail to follow, sort yep. of. Yep. Okay. Yeah. So it's basically doing what it did in the last game, but if you're just cruising around looking for stuff, it'll all be clean. I'm enjoying this so far, Reiner. Feels good. Yeah, it looks nice. Roll! Oh, was I supposed to hit a button there? Yeah, I think you can land cleanly. Okay, you do have to hit square a bunch of times. Okay. 
Good to know. I hope the hold R1 is just there for the tutorial. You know hold, what I mean? Just oh. like. Oh, yeah, like th through the course of the like game. Like that. Like, yeah, we get how to do that. Uh, I'm probably fine. Maybe you need those buttons. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, let's get rid of those prompts. It's like, I just totally screwed it up. Yeah, I'm curious how this multiplayer stuff plays out, this kind of co op -y asynchronous stuff um, and, and the world itself. And it looks like they're spending a little bit more money on cutscenes. We had some real-time cutscenes. The last game was all comic book, if you yeah, remember. Yeah, there were a few that were like actual, you know, in-game animation. You but go. yeah, for the most part, you're right. They were just, I got to press it twice here. Is that how it works? Ah, okay, I got right it. at it. All right, let's see. Here we go. One, two. And the stylish three. takedowns, it zooms out to third person. I don't remember. Did uh, that hasn't happened yet. The first game do that? I don't think. No, definitely not. Because uh, <laughs> the reason I know that I didn't yeah, do it do because the wall and then that. Yeah, the reason I know because like some some uh, modders uh, sort of played around with the game and got a third person view. Oh no! And it was awful. Like the game was never supposed to be seen that way. Right. Uh, and it looked really funny. Yeah, it's like if you saw the Firewatch dev videos of what it look, looks like when your hands. Oh yeah. Like, when it zooms out hands. to third person. Yeah, okay, it's hilarious. See. Do I? I guess I jump into Hold that L1. little section there. Yep. Okay, I thought I was supposed to be doing some like wall running or stuff there. Oof, I thought you missed that. There we go. Ah, what am I supposed <laughs> to press there? There's some button that'll save you. <laughs> the not hurt my ankles button? Yeah, it seriously looks like you're breaking your ankles. I don't need them. There are case like everywhere. Look for a zip line leading to Orion. I don't remember the night cycle, if there was a night cycle in the first game. I don't think very there was, white. actually. Yeah. The funny thing about the first game is it was like, this city is awful. And I was like, oh, it actually looks kind of nice. It's nice and clean. Yeah, I'd live there. It's like Apple designed the city. What am I supposed to press there? Oh, you know what I'm supposed to press? I bet the crouch button. The L, that, that one. I'll try that. Let's see. Mm -hmm. ta 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 Nice. I was gonna say if you just open that normally, we have problems. <laughs> Who are you anyway? When did you join the cabal? About a year ago. Well, I grew up with that. Cool dude. So how about you cut me some damn? <laughs> you also got caught and caused a whole lot of trouble for Noah. You don't know what happened. I know enough, and I know that I'm faster and safer than you. Faith, are you at Orion yet? Be so mean, guy. Those sunglasses are like from 1983. Knock it off. Alright, done. Good. Faith, use the mod to freshen up your fighting skills before you go on. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm hitting square and things are going pretty well. Don't worry, Noah. I can do it. I know you can. I see Noah has faith in me. Sleeve, what happens? Sleeveless when... sunglasses, man. Yeah, what happens when you get tougher enemies? So it's like a stun? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, that's cool. Right. Your attacks, or Kasek will anticipate you and strike back. <laughs> oh, so you can knock him down. Okay, long stumbles. Kazakhs. Okay. All right. Cool. And even better, of course, is if you knock them into one another. Two for one. Nice. That's nice. That's cool. I guess... Oh, nope. I screwed that one up. I guess the idea is here is, like, it's not necessarily that... Like in those fights in that situation, you're probably not engaging, but it's mostly right. like get out of the way and then you keep going, right? Like it's about it's about sort of working your way through a crowd. Right. I guess we'll find right. out, which seems like a pretty cool idea. Ah, I forgot to hit that button again. It's not I, what they wanted, but I like I it. think I did it right. I hit triangle <laughs> at like the very last second. No, you want to land on them. Mario style? Yeah, Goomba. Boom. There was actually an achievement for that in the first game. Uh, for... Nice oh, right in the crotch. like that. Uh, for landing on somebody's head. It was like, I forgot what it was called, but it was... Okay. So I gotta time these. Just right, Faith. Right what were you thinking? You don't... Well, I thought... Because <laughs> some of them said, like, hold down triangle. 
So like I like I thought maybe I could start running and just have triangle held down, but it looks like I do need to kind of time it correctly. Okay, which obviously makes sense. I'm not supposed to go that way. I'm supposed to go this way. All right, I held on the button that time. Nice. Uh. Whoa. Okay. Super Track. Mario! Yeah. Okay. Why? What difference would that make? Oof. What? I did that right. Come on, game. Man, the city looks nice. There we go. Whoa. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Sometimes. That's kind of what this game's all about, is just like... Yeah, parkour, speed. So you can do okay, it kind of... You could do it correctly and oh. keep momentum, or you could do it correctly and not have momentum, or you could just butcher it like Kyle's doing right here. I'm showing you how to do it the wrong way. Nice. But cool. it is a, it's all about like hanging on there like right at the last second. Like, are you going to make it? Are you going to make it? Yep, you made it. There we go. Uh, let's continue. I'm ready, Noah. Mwah. Screw you, door. Who opens doors better, Leon, Kennedy, or Faith? Oh, that was sweet. Oh, that was with the... Uh... Oh, Kyle. I got the first one. Oh, you didn't. Okay, good. Oh, here we go. Things are getting for serious now. No, it's not for play anymore. Get out of here. Nobody likes you. are talking about some special unit being sent in. It could be a new drone or something. Be careful, both of you. Yeah, get out of here. Let's see. This is fun. Yeah, it looks great. I should have, I should have, what I should have done there. I'm is, all um, about this. I should have run along the wall like this. I don't yeah. think I did that right, but whatever. Keep going. <laughs> yeah, uh, he's good knocked out. Going okay. Here. He's knocked out. All right. You tried to put them into each other there? Yeah, I was trying to. This would be interesting to see well. two guys at once. And I guess in those instances where you really get outnumbered, just keep going, right? Yeah, I think most of the time you can't do that. Right, let's see. Looks like you could have done a double there and maybe just landed it on your feet. Double wall run. Oh, oh, that's a friend. <laughs> I was like running up the wall, getting ready to punch somebody. Oh, wait, I don't think that is a friend. That's a Kung Fu master. <laughs> huh? I did not have control there, uh, by the way. I like that. Or at least I don't think I did. Very Tron, Tron-y soundtrack. What? <laughs> like what? Hang out on this balcony? <laughs> oh, this is different. Oh, I thought you were Oh, yeah, I did too. I was like, that's new. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna punch that guy later. That guy's getting punched. And away we go. Is I going the right way here? Yeah. It's kind of looping me back around. That guy has better things to do. He's gonna go update his Facebook page or something. Nice. I like that little move where you grab the uh, pipe. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. A little spin. Shoop. <laughs> Always red. <laughs> that was kind of like, hey, I know where I'm going. I'm a full speed ahead. And I'm like, oh, no, that's not, that's not a thing. Ooh, you got to jump off. Then. Okay. No. Oh. oh, I had to go ah. a little higher. I got too eager. Too eager. I had too much. Shift after hard landing to quickly accelerate back up to speed. I guess that's like hitting L2. They call it shift then? I guess so. I think I mean I assume I'm hitting the right button. Like you'd think it would be that roll, that crouch button, right? That would that's what you'd yeah. wanna like do. I am way on board with this so far. I'm enjoying this, yeah. I worry about the open world activity stuff a little bit, like time trials and, and stuff like that. 
your typical concerns with open world games, right? Of yeah. Like the ring races, stuff like that. How much variety is there, all that stuff. But as far as just the general campaign story stuff that we're seeing right here, you know, these are part of uh, Faith's story missions. Pretty cool. I like. I definitely like the idea of, of like just little quick interactions with enemies. Just boom, move on, boom, move on. You know, like that I'm enjoying. And we have to assume that's the beginning of the game here that we're seeing. Is, yeah. It'll probably be tweaked, you know, there'll probably be little changes here and there, but overall, I imagine Let's see that how this opens up here. Faith. Faith. Hey, we're soaking it in. Hold on. Oh, nice. The drops. Okay. So, come on home. What do I hit? L1, I hope. Oh, nice. They have the stunt thing set up. You know, the cardboard boxes under the tarp. Free running builds focus shield. Okay. Up and R2 to shift and start running. Okay. They want you to do it now. There you go. So that is like a little bit of a sprint. There. Yeah. Okay. Okay, it's a little bit. All right, okay. Let's see. The wisp is a little much in telling you where to go. Like, we already have the red outlines yeah maybe it's... i never i know a lot of people would like kind of complain about that to, to have too much direction it never bugged me too much because it was showing you fun routes to take but it does feel like a little, a little bit much I, I can figure out where i'm going yeah i mean it's clear as day it's right there oh almost hit the wrong button there okay yeah all this most of the jumping controls are like on the R2, L1, you know, that kind of stuff so that you don't really, you can always, you never have to take your finger off the right thumbstick until you get in a fight. Oh, I wonder what those points are for, too. Are you guys? Those are other runners. Practicing. That's cool. I don't know why that didn't work the first time. Nice. Okay. It's a mannequin, dude. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I almost got it. Hold on. Okay, never mind. Here we go. Every way <laughs> Some questionable fashion in this world. <laughs> that they're wearing or just their house? It's kind of like Mad Max with a budget. I heard some leather jackets. Today. I heard she's eager to run. She's been gone a long time. I also heard she's sorry. Maybe she learned something while she was away. Hey, they're, they're talking about Maybe. faith, right? Okay. Yeah. I'm so sorry. <sighs> you look older. Uh, do you screw you? <laughs> <laughs> nice place you got here. Mind if I stay a while? I was hoping you would. And about that run? Go talk to Birdman. He'll put you through your paces. New guy. Seems a bit uptight. Hey, Chris? Mm-hmm. Oh, he's a good kid. He runs better than anyone. Than anyone? Go talk to Birdman, and we'll see. All right, I'll be here. I wonder if this is a hub or... I don't know. Dogen sent me a greeting. Yeah. We'll deal with them in time. All right. Now go. Astound me. We gotta go talk to Birdman. <laughs> Welcome back. Good to see you again. Please leave. <laughs> go to work. By the way, Faith, there's a package waiting I'll call you. I a, hope it's a loot crate. Is it a sleeveless shirt? My clothes. Nice. No man brought them here just after you were caught. Yeah, screw sleeves. Run, real runners don't wear sleeves. Like Icarus. Oh, I can buy upgrades. Okay, do I need to buy anything right now? Well, let's see what it is. Upgrade points obtained. Okay. Let's see what do you got here. Uh, focus shield, free running, 
What do they do? Go down. Can you go down? Uh, oh yeah, let's see. So these are ones I already okay. have. Springboard okay, wall run. L two hold close. There it is. Oh, that's the Skill one. So roll. I don't so have that don't have it yet. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Raise your legs while in the air. Okay. You cool. have one point. You can't use it. Anymore. I got to use it for beat map. Oh, okay. Do you see that anywhere? No. It's these are moves. So go down to gear probably. One more down. There you ah, go. there we go. A map of Glass City containing all important locations, activities, and information a runner needs. Cool. So you could... Yeah, that's cool. Oh, so this is interesting. So it's like a 3D map. So I can set that as a waypoint. Okay, so is this but the But you could just... Go out there and just see if... See if you could just start running. Like, don't even I set I don't know a, if the beta will let you do that, but... Yeah, don't set the waypoint yet. Let's just run a little and then hit the the waypoint. You know what? I don't think it's going to let me leave the map. Ah, okay. That's too bad. But I bet you could do that. Yeah, I think so. Let's see. All right. There you go. Maybe I can just go off the, the trail. Yeah, get out of the building first, obviously. Cool showers. Wait. Are they? No. Wait. It's just... That's awful. <laughs> it's like they have, it's like this secure, it's like this privacy curtain, but then you can just like... <laughs> All right. Yeah. You guys need to take some architectural sort of lessons from your oppressors here. Okay. Okay. Got that. All right. So it was telling me where to go. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Oh, crap. That's cool. And this is, uh, if you haven't figured it out already, this is the PS4 there beta. Yeah. What do you want? Oh, just to look at you while you're still in one. Place. Did you see that? The collectible Don't stuff. Fifteen grid leaks. Okay. And he'll get it. Yes. Yes, he will. Now run along. So Dogen broke me out. Like he helped me get out. Now I owe him. I guess is that sort of the situation? Sure. Or, am I reading into that correctly? I think so. Okay. So. That, should I kind of... Yeah, let's just see. Does it update the kind of like a map? You look in, like an uh, open world driving game. Does it readjust? It does. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So it's a good like, little GPS. So I can... Okay. You can just tool around and then even yeah, see what happens here. Yeah, that's cool. How's it going? Way better now that you're out. And it just so happens that I could also use your help. Oh, I'm on my way to Birdman. Yeah, I heard. I'm just kind of going just wherever. I wonder how many interiors they have like this, too. Hey, guys. All right. I like that foot. Yeah, follow the waypoint. Let's All right, go. let's go waypoint time. We're running out of time, but let's just get there. Okay. <laughs> sound <laughs> sound design, her, That's her cool. shoes on there. Yeah. I wonder if it's different for the new shoes she has on. Oh, maybe. Well, we in. didn't notice. I guess we didn't run across any glass yeah. last time. And All right, so I can sprint a little now. Shing, shing. As soon as you're done with Birdman, we'll see about getting your situation with Dolan sorted out. Well, then we can put all this behind us. Okay, let's see. Is this? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember these kind of things where you had to grab. Yeah, it's a little tricky. Let's see. So I think I want to... Am I... I... Okay, here we go. Oh, I didn't... All right, look for the red. Duh. I didn't realize that was something I could grab onto. Are you a thing? Yeah. All right, you're a thing. And I can't go out that way. Okay. I, did, I didn't know if maybe I need to go that way. Look for the red. Sweet pigeons. All right. I don't think I'm supposed to go that way. No, the red's clearly showing you where to go. Is it? Let's see. I feel like I've already screwed up here. Yeah, Let's it's see. right there. There you go. Noah sent you to talk to Birdman, one of the first ones in the city, an old friend. This building has a few hoops for you to jump through in order to prove your skill. Okay. Yeah, I think there's some time trial stuff in this... this beta as well. Yeah, so it's still kind of throwing me through easy, some training. Easy there. Leave my door alone. Patience never was your virtue, Faith. 
Thought you were taking a nap. Isn't what old people do? Careful with that mouth, girl. I guess I two gotta, years of peace that's why he's a is all I get. Yeah, I missed you too. Yeah, I, I like the new production values here with the, the story sequences. I like the comic stuff too, but mm -hmm. I mean, I like getting it more fleshed out like this. Yeah, it makes it all uh, that sort of consistency. It sort of helps, you know. You Calliope, get off of me! Damn rats with wings! Never leave me alone. But they have their uses. <laughs> Patience never was your virtue. True. That's why I can smell my own. So virtue? Uh, a little bit of frame rate issue going on at this point. Show the mother runners that you still got a couple months. Too. Yeah, who knows how old this is? Yeah. It's good to have you back, girl. I like their uh, vision of the future here, though. It's, it's very cool. The drones flying around, and everything being super clean. Sweet. Okay, we'll do one of these and then call it a day. How about that? Sure, yeah. It looks like I wonder if it's a quick Good restart. Luck. Let's see, hold on, so you don't have it. that move yet. Yeah, that would be helpful. I want to see how quick the restart is, real quick. Okay, that's pretty. That's that's pretty good. Like it's that's I was like in these sort of situations where it's like that's a little better landing. Yeah, I hit L two that time. Yeah, maybe there is one there, but you don't have the roll yet. Yeah, maybe it's not as good as it could be. I like this that they don't give you that fuzzy line for these these trials. Yeah, you got a couple arrows here. Let's see. Oh, okay, that worked. No, yeah, that's good. Oh. oh okay. That was it. Cool. What'd you get? Two stars. Pretty good for a now, first try. Now take a look at your map real quick. Oh, that's cool. All right. Is that like a iPad? All right. So I can either I can restart it or I can. I think leave. it said you're rank three. Yeah, plastic. You're plastic three. All right. I got an upgrade there. All right. Let's see. Interesting. How do I look at the map? Okay. Hey, there you go. So let's see. What are those things? So I got. Zephyr Transit Hub. Fragile Delivery. So that's like a side quest there, I mm -hmm. think. More dash. Hyrule, yep. Hackable billboard. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I've seen a lot of billboards around. Follow the red. Okay, complete the dash. And where's... So do we... Uh, I guess that's probably your story sequence then, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, meet up with the nomad. Okay. So the red one, our story. Okay. Okay. Well, that is a brief look at mirror's edge catalyst um looks pretty cool again the beta is starting here very soon um there's the front runner program which kicks off a day early i imagine that's for probably people for reserve it i would think something like that right probably uh, yeah access stuff like that and uh but thanks for watching the video and uh again we'll see you next time in game informers Dust chamber see ya